Hey gang, Mr. Miracle Comics is having a contest, an 80 years of Batman contest. And I thought he wanted us to show 80 Batman comics, so I got them all ready, but he actually didn't want that at all. He wants us to show two books that we think are undervalued. So here I've got Wolverine number 80, the first appearance of X-23 as a vial of goo. I mean, if a preview cover counts as a cameo, certainly a clearly labeled test tube of genetic material should count for something. And I've got Batman 475, the first appearance of Rene Montoya. And forget about her becoming the question in the comics. What I want to focus on is the animated series. Because think of it this way, where did the Mr. Freeze's wife storyline in Batman and Robin come from? Where did merchandising darling Harley Quinn come from? The animated series, and Rene Montoya was featured prominently in the animated series. Hollywood executives are going to look more toward the animation than the comics because they can't read. And I think collectors are slow to pick this up because they're like, well, she's going to be in Birds of Prey, but whatever. She's some lady cop who will be a side character, I guarantee. Since she's featured in the animated series, she will be the next breakout character. So thank you to Mr. Miracle Comics. Thank you for this contest. I'll have your link in the description and at the end of the video. Yes, I I guarantee that Rene Montoya will be featured prominently in the Birds of Prey movie, or just cut from the film either way. Because when they get to the eighth origin of all these characters who are in the movie, and the runtime's like three hours, 45 minutes, I'm sure someone's going to be looking at their watch saying, uh, let's cut someone, maybe the lady cop. And then fans can tweet hashtag, release the Rene Montoya cut.